failed to computer. How do you reset your miles uh, from the old bike to the new bike? I transferred this trail tech from the old bike to this new bike and the miles are all screwed up. Uh, thanks for one of my subscribers. I was able to, to figure this thing out. Uh, he sent me an email um, as far as that goes. So I got an email uh, from him. He's a, a very, very nice guy from Australia, which seems to have all the tricks and secrets. I'm not sure why he's not making his own videos. Um, at this point, what happened is that when I transferred the computer, um, I had $152 on the vapor, but only $73 on the bike. So I had to um, uh, always do the calculations as far as that goes. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to reset the, uh, the onboard computer as far as that goes. Um, I've done it already. I know it works, so I'm going to show you. Uh, here it is. Press all three buttons. There it is. And then uh, I'm going to go to the uh, next mode where it says life. And I'm going to go at life and I'm going to type in this following code. And then I'm going to go to the next. I'm going to type in that code again because now that's going to put me into programming mode. 9110 press in three seconds and now once that 12 hour shows up you're gonna go next 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 shift and now th this is the odometer so right now the odometer I've done the calculations over here is 872 so I'm gonna go with the left button to 8 so I'm gonna type in an 8 over here 87 and then two, right? And then I'm gonna go next with the middle and ART. ART is the number of hours on the bike. So I have, a, a, let's see, I have 120 hours and 0.17, but that just doesn't really matter. Okay, so I'll put it 120.17. And now I push the middle button and then reset itself uh, to those hours. So let's see, 120 hours, odometer 872. Now this has been done. So now the, the, the computer is synced up to this motorcycle. Um, now you have to program everything else in it. So press all these three buttons. This is not gonna reset it anymore. Um, I'm gonna go units, uh, miles, uh, life of the tire. My tire is 2209, that's the most accurate. I'm gonna go next. Uh, 12 hours, I'm going to go next, I'm going to type in my hour, so it's 3, and then uh, 4, 41, I know this is boring, but, three forty-one. Well, this is um, uh, pulse per, per rotation, so 1 is good, uh, I'm not going to touch that, uh, uh, units in Fahrenheit, that's what I want, um, too high, so that temperature is too high. Usually I put it at 230. And then dangerous, 200 and... Usually I put it 250. What I do will turn this light on over here on the side. 250. Uh, shift I don't care because I, I, I know when to shift. Uh, the odometer is good. The ART is good. So, uh, yeah, now the bike is, is all reset. So now we're looking at the... Um, a, uh, ART and the odometer, they all look uh, what they're supposed to. Um, thank you very much, uh, Australian guy, for this. Um, he goes by the name of Gaza. Uh, this was very, very helpful. I really appreciate it. Um, and you made a video, man. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, biggest Romaniac out.